Welcome back to our video series, A Complete Guide to Starting a Website. So far, we've purchased web hosting, we've purchased a domain name, and we've installed WordPress. And now we're ready to install a WordPress theme to give our page a nice looking theme, a nice looking design. So we're back at our website, and you'll see since the last video I made a few changes. It's still the same theme, but I entered some dummy data here just to give it a little bit more feel of a website so there's a couple posts you'll notice there's a couple additional pages that weren't there before that's just so you can see when we change a theme how much it changes the design of your website so we're going to log back into our wordpress admin panel so again that's your domain name dot com slash wp hyphen admin your username and password and then here we are. Now if you are already logged in, let's head back to our website. The top bar across here, if you're logged into your site already, will give you some options. So if you're already logged in, you can just click up here and click Dashboard. And that will bring you back to your Dashboard page. Now for this video, we're going to install a theme. Again, a lot of themes are free, and that's what this will cover. So you want to go over to the left and click Appearance, and then Themes. Now, there's <clears throat> it shows us the theme that we're currently using, as well as themes that are also installed. So we want to install a new theme. And on this page, there's a number of things you can do. You can just search by featured themes, newest themes, recently updated. We'll use that in a second. If you know the name of a theme you want to use, you can type that in here. If you want to filter based on different features, then you can use that here. We could look, for example, let's see a blue color scheme with two columns and then down at the bottom hit find themes. And it's going to give us a list of themes that fit that description. So a blue theme, two column, and then if you find one that you like, you can preview it or click install now. So I'm not a big fan of any of those right off the bat. So let's head back to our search again. And let's take a look at the featured because they're likely one of the better themes. And you can see already some, some nice designs here. And again, these are all free. So let's just choose the first one. It must be popular. And we'll click Install Now. On the next page, you can look at a preview or we want to activate. So we're going to activate. Now you'll notice our appearance tab changed. Down here on the left, now there's options specifically for the theme that we're using, and that's what we're on right now. So we can go through and we can change a lot of different things with this particular theme. Let's see what it looks like without changing anything. And already from our website, there's a big change in appearance. Much better. The paragraphs are cut down shorter. A nice date nice interactive titles whichever article you highlight over the color of the title changes so just without even changing anything else it's a much better design let's click on a blog article that looks nice we scroll down so not bad pretty good layout for free so every website is going to be a little bit different every theme is going to interact a little different so I'm not going to show you exactly how to modify and change every aspect of it. We'll cover some of that in a future video. But again, if you want to change your theme, it's simple. We go back, we install a new theme, and let's let's just type something. Uh, let's go back to the featured. And let's take a peek at this one. We'll install that now. Then we'll activate and without changing anything else, just activating a new theme, we completely changed our website, gave it a whole new look. And that's the power of WordPress. You get all these designs so you can find one that meets your needs. Then each theme has a number of options that you can change as well. So that's it for this video. It shows you how to install a free theme. The next video, I'm going to show you my preferred premium themes. A premium theme is a theme that has a little bit more design to it. It's designed by a professional and it gives it 
you have a little more bells and whistles, usually a little bit more customizable, and often better performance as well. But sometimes a free theme can do just fine. So don't feel you need to spend the money on a premium theme if you find a free theme that works well for you. Now before we end the video, there is another option to find free themes. You can always go on Google and just type free WordPress themes and you get a number of options. In that case, when you come back to themes, if you find one that you'd like to use, when you click install themes, rather than going through the search function, you found it online, you're going to download a file, then you'll click upload, and then you'll just browse your computer and find where you saved that file and then install now. So you don't have to use a theme directly through WordPress, you can find one online. So again, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.